How's everything? Good. Is this is a little bit of a date night for the two of you. Yeah, we'll take it. No, we'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And you are nominated tonight. Yeah. Uh, when you were researching Grace Kelly, was, I'm sure you met with people who knew her, right, Nicole? Or did you? Maybe maybe I I'm wrong to assume. And I, no, no, I met, um, yeah, I met a lot of people. Not a lot of people who knew her, but a number of people. Yeah. And I also um, just studied her. Um, my mum adored her, so my whole life, you know, it was always Grace Kelly. She was the, you know, you could fall into the Marilyn Monroe camp or the Grace Kelly camp, right? My mum was the Grace Kelly camp. She was part of the Grace yeah, Kelly yeah. camp. I like that. I I'd like say that. you, well, what are you? Uh, the U camp? <laughs> Yeah. Great answer. You can't choose me. Yeah, I can. It's actually. Marilyn or Grace. <laughs> no. No comment. No Where do comment. You fall? Grace Kelly. Yeah. See. Love. I mean, just forever. I just think she was the epitome of grace and beauty yeah. and just oh my gosh. And then to be nominated and to be recognized must just be such a thrill because not only are you, you know, in a role really of a lifetime in a role that you followed as a child but then to be nominated must be so wonderful yeah well I mean the the film itself had such a strange journey so for it to culminate in this was really lovely and um, and I just love I love what I do I'm just very very grateful that I get to do what I do still you know it's something I'm just I've known I wanted to be an actress since I was little um, I've given so much to the craft and I just feel very honored to be able to still be doing it. And you've played so many wonderful roles, so many great performances. Is there still anything on, you know, on your acting bucket list, if you will, that you haven't done yet that you would love to do? So many. I mean, I feel like I, yeah, I feel like I would, I still haven't been tapped in terms of what, what I can do. So I just, so much of it is about the directors you work with. So whether you get that right um, sort of alchemy, I suppose, and um, and you know, but but at this, I just did a play in London, which was at this stage of my life the greatest thing I could have done because I fell in love with being able to connect with the audiences. Every evening um, after you do the performance, you get to go out at stage door and meet the people that are coming to the play sign talk to them talk to them about the, the play and the it, that for me is what it's all about and Keith I have to ask you you know I'm also on H I do HSN and I bought your guitar the Irving guitar. I love it I, love it. I yeah. bought it for my husband and we're learning together you're a very good teacher you really are <laughs> has that been fun for you to do because you're making it accessible yeah. to so many people like I never thought in a million years I could learn to play the guitar or my husband could learn to play the guitar he never thought he could do it and is that a, a, the nice part of that yeah I, I, singularly absolutely yeah I really I, there's so many people want to play guitar and, it, and it's not as complicated as everybody approaches it. Right. I try to eradicate a lot of that nonsense. Well, we love it. Thank you. Thank you. to It's healing. He always says it's such a great thing to, um, to play music or to listen to music, but to play it is so healing. Well, thank you, the both of you. Thank so you. So nice to see yeah. you. Nice Nicole, see very yeah. nice to see you. Bye-bye. Bye. Who are you wearing, by the way, Nicole? Gucci. Beautiful, beautiful. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs>